you've got to be happy with this lot six bull he's a pin a and his pole yeah not very often uh, you get pole pin a's uh, ben and uh, we bred pin a to a polled rio bravo real solid real thick um a cow and uh, yeah the results are just where we wanted them he's got uh, a beautiful skin uh, lovely depth of flank uh, probably more than most pinnays and uh, just shows a real lovely thickness and outlook in this bull and the top 10% of the breed for 200 400 600 day weight uh, but also you look at his carcass figures and uh, you know top 5% for carcass weight and very close to being a trait leader for eye muscle area yeah, look, uh, Pinay certainly put some uh, eye muscle into these, uh, you know, polled uh, American genetics. And uh, look, he's he's another one that every time he came came onto the scale, he actually reflects his figures, and uh, we love to see that in the EBVs when uh, the EBVs are so good. But when he steps on the scales, too, Ben, he's uh, he really reflects those numbers. That's exactly right. I mean, the, but the other thing to add to this bull is that he's an easy trait leader for IMF, which is great for those Angus breeders that want to keep a bit of marble. Yeah, and look, mo our full draft has, has very good IMF. There's no doubt about it, Ben, and uh, it, it, it's a really nice to have. There's no there's no doubt about that, and uh, this bull is uh, certainly right up there with the rest of the draft, and uh, it's, um, it's something we don't necessarily breed for, but it's certainly a great thing to have, and this bull has got, got it in spades, Ben.